I'm Kathleen Conley, Vice President for Animal Research Issues at the Humane Society of the United States. So in 2009, we released the results of our undercover investigation at New Iberia Research Center, which was the world's largest chimpanzee laboratory. And thankfully, today, we are getting all of the government-owned chimpanzees from New Iberia retired to Chimpaven. These animals, you know, were names on a spreadsheet. Where they came from, they saw terrible things happen to each other on a daily basis. And so seeing the chimpanzees look up to the sky without having bars over their heads, you can tell they feel relaxed and they don't feel like they're in danger. To come here and get to know them a little bit more individually, it's been fantastic to see. And one chimpanzee who seems to be standing out is a little four-year-old named Arden. Arden spent the first three years of her life in that laboratory. She comes from four generations of chimpanzees being forced to live a life in a laboratory. It is amazing to see that this animal is going to be given the opportunity to live like a chimpanzee should. When you visit a place like Chimpaven, you can just see the personalities coming through. Arden, whose personality was so clear when we got down there, how precocious she is and how fun-loving. A perfect moment that I've been really waiting for was when we got to look at the chimpanzees, especially Arden, climbing trees. You know, these are the moments that I've been waiting for as we've worked so hard to get chimpanzees out of laboratories. I came from a laboratory where I saw how animals are treated and I made a promise that when I left there, I would change things for them. So, coming here and seeing chimpanzees like Arden, I mean, she's gonna get to live a life climbing trees and being with other friends and this is what it's all about. The Humane Society of the United States works every day to prevent the suffering of animals, and your help is critical. Please be a hero for animals and make a special gift today to support all of the work that we do.